This video will address the heat exchanger cleaning process for EnergyLogic 140H and 200H waste oil furnaces. You'll need to clean the ash from the heat exchanger every 800 to 1000 hours of operation. That's about once per year or twice for cold climates. Use the hour meter on the furnace cabinet to keep track of hours between cleanings. Note that you should also clean your burner and preheater annually as per manufacturer recommendation. Here's a list of tools you'll need. 5 16 inch nut driver, half inch wrench, three quarter inch wrench, five eighth inch wrench, energy logic furnace cleaning tool, chimney brush, small wire brush, work gloves, a dust mask, safety glasses, a large heavy duty plastic trash bag, and heavy duty duct tape. Energy logic also offers flue brush accessories. Before you begin, make sure that the furnace is cool. Step one, unplug the burner at the cabinet wiring box. Step two, close the hand valve on the bottom of the preheater and disconnect the 3 8 inch copper tubing. Use a rag to wipe up any oil that drips out during the process. Step three, remove the four burner mounting nuts at the end of the cabinet and swing the burner door open. Use the wire brush to clean ash from the flame retention head on the burner. Step four, remove the two screws from the drip cap and baffle on the bottom of the cabinet. Slowly lower the cap and baffle. Dump the ash into the trash bag and scrape any ash from the baffle. Then tape the opening of the trash bag to the drip leg with heavy duty duct tape so ash will be contained in the trash bag. Step five, insert the furnace cleaning tool into the burner opening. Push any ash located inside the heat exchanger to the opposite end of the exchanger and through the clean out port into the trash bag. Step six, insert the flue brush into the clean out port. Reattach the trash bag to the drip leg and reach through it to grasp the flue brush. Use the brush to clean out any ash remaining in the flue. Step seven, replace the gaskets for the burner and drip cap. These come standard with the EnergyLogic annual maintenance kit. Inspect the heat exchanger and flue for damaged parts that might need to be replaced. Step eight, reattach the drip cap. Make sure the baffle is facing toward the burner and reattach screws into their existing holes. Step nine, swing the burner back over its four studs and reinstall the nuts. Reinstall the fuel tubing on the preheater and open the hand valve. Log the cleaning in your maintenance log and be sure to perform all startup and system checks before starting the furnace again. For other instructional videos and more information about our products, visit us at energylogic.com.